Okay, hello, collective. I love you guys. Welcome to Pound Star Oracle. Um, so I'm on. I've done pulled out this reading, and I thought I would share it with you all. And please, uh, hit hit the bell and hit subscribe so you'll be notified of every time I upload here on YouTube. All right. Okay, so um, I'm gonna read them up their lies. So this King of Pentacles, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Uh, this might be an Aries Taurus. It's like a double Taurus in Aries. Uh, it could be that sign in particular, a Taurus. This is someone who is um, the wealthy. They're at the bottom of the wheel at the moment. That's why it's coming upside down. They're at the bottom of the wheel. They're, they're losing out on money because they didn't tell this star, this star Aquarius, the truth. Uh, they were supposed to heal a certain relationship with this person, but they chose to to not heal it. So now the divine is paying them back with karma of they they're they're losing out on money. They're having money trouble, and uh, this was the karmic justice. This Aquarius has a lot of Libra in her. That's why it pulled out right beside. Okay. And, and I do. I have more of this than anything. I'm a judge for tarot land. And when you when I see it, people steals from me, I blur you out. I've been blurring it out. And this one woman's going down, down way big for stealing all my work and my ideas. And she got 50,000 subscribers since June Collective. She's 333 intuitive. She ain't. She ain't intuitive. Y'all need to watch her. And you'll see. But anyway, karmic justice is playing out, and uh, this person uh, got caught up in a situation. Um, they they got caught up in their own trap because they didn't tell their emotions and pour out their emotions to this woman like they're supposed to. They they wanted to have a a family, a ten of cups. That's what they wanted. They wanted to have a Ten of Cups life. Or, you know, this could be someone that this star is married to and you've been waiting on an answer to come to you from this man and, and they're keeping you feeling stuck in this marriage so you don't move forward to this established strength of you becoming a spiritual mentor and leader. That's the Hierophant, you know. That's, a, that's Taurus energy. And this could be... Uh, I think it's saying that this situation they're caught up in is, is this marriage. They've made you wait and wait on an answer in your marriage about juggling. See how a woman is juggling, juggling. This man's been juggling a someone else behind your back. That's why no success is coming to you, Miss Ma'am. And I am a star. And I tell you right now, whoever's fucked with my success and they, they got this other woman to steal all my ideas, I know who you are, ma'am. You're a different color than me and you're going to go down because I know exactly that you come and stole from me. And transformation, there's a breakthrough. You reinvented yourself. You're ready for the next level. That's the outcome. The outcome is you've been waiting on results. You've been waiting on this person to tell you... uh to tell you something, uh, you you was waiting on a resolution with this person to come to you in your sacred space. You need to keep prayed up at the moment, Collective, because um, there's a lot of people that's holding resentment at the moment. They're they're angry. They're angry and they're bitter at, over your words or my or my words. Somebody's bitter over my words and. And what it's saying is, alone, they feel abandoned. They feel abandoned by you. Um, they might have a lot of childhood issues. This person feels lonely and lost without you, but the divine is with me and you, collective. They feel apprehensive. They're guarding their self. They're guarding their self and their thoughts at the moment. They feel, uh, they feel afraid because they know they lied to you. Deception. You unmasked this person. You unmasked them. This was all an illusion. You had to look beyond this superficial surface level marriage. Okay? You had to look beyond or situationship, whichever one. Separation, no contact. They're lying about not being in contact with someone you told them to not be in contact with. They are. I think they're with their ex. That's why this came out. They've been juggling Karmic justice says, you're balanced. And this person that's been juggling you, they're fucked. Oh, and then we got mystery. You know, 
This is about uh, magic, magic working inside of you, intrigue, suspense, you're entering unknown territory, and that's okay. It's going to be an upheaval. It's going to be a shock, but something unexpected is going to happen. You're, you're going to walk through this. You're going to walk through this little tunnel and leave this son of a bitch because you've waited and waited, and you're tired of waiting. You're tired of waiting on an answer that's never going to come. It's never going to come. That's why they're guarded and cautious at the moment. They can't let go of their motherfucking pride. That's all it is. They can't let go of their ego. They're an arrogant bastard, and they have stubborn love. The time has go has come to let it go, to let this mother sucker go. And I think Christmas time is the best time. You love my new little trees I put out here, and then you can tell me go ahead. Okay, so then what I pulled out was inventor, mathematician, intellectual, ph philosopher, scientist. And what it says here, that this was a lesson of power. This person has power over you. They made you uh, loss of reputation or status. They made you, they ruined your reputation in town. Mystic person, mystical, mysteries, mystic person. This is a grandparent. So this is a Taurus man that is an actual grandparent. It doesn't have to be your grandparent. It's just a grandparent. And uh, they followed you from the Crusades and Inquisition time. That's when they followed you from the Oceana. Uh, but uh, they're mad about an affair. Uh, they're having an affair. This grandfather is having an affair behind your back. And they're trying to ruin your reputation. Did you hear that? They're trying to ruin your reputation. Uh, so... What it says right here, mathematician, scientist, intellectual, this person is a is a narcissist. They're a very intelligent narcissist, and this was a love of convenience. They pretended that it was true love, but it isn't. They have a star-crossed love, and, and you, you might have been waiting on this unrequited love to tell you something, but all I know is... Uh, lesson conformity passive conformity you've been uh letting this motherfucker passively walk over your ass they're trying to torture you don't you get it they're trying to fucking torture you then it says location underground civilization maybe this man works underground all i know is they've trauma they've trauma bonded with you and it's a psychological or verbal abuse it's probably all of them. Maybe you got the hell beat out of you. And they're in a cult. They're in a cult. They got a cult to work against you. To work against you and this friend to come together. Because they know that this person loves you as a friend dearly. They love you as a friend dearly. And that time frame goes back to American Civil War era. So it's, this narcissist is mad because... You unmask that they are in a love of... They, you, this is a convenience marriage. Do you get it? Okay, and then we have identity. Older man, star-crossed love. Oh, star-crossed love. Here's what they're going to be real mad about when they find out that they are, a G, they are an LGBTQ, so they're a G. Star-crossed love, or a B. Oh, you're seeing the bigger picture, death, war. Baltics or Central Europe. Physical or sexual abuse. Huh. So, uh, so whoever this man is, they are in love. They have a true love with another man. And I just brought it out. So whoever this man is, that fucked with your stability and your wealth star. It doesn't have to be a partner of yours. This could be somebody you worked with. But if this is a husband, whoever this son of a bitch is, they're screwing a man behind your back. And the divine just brought it out. I unmasked that situation right there. They're, they're too, they're too uh, arrogant and prideful to tell you the truth. But the time has come that the divine is bringing it all out. It's all clear to see. It's all clear to see that this transformation is happening. You've been waiting on an outcome in your sacred space. You've been waiting on an answer from this man. You're not going to get it. They they resent you. They resent you. 
They, they, they are wanting, uh, they, they don't want to be alone, but they're hanging on to you. They don't want to be alone. No, but the divine is with me and you collective. And this person that is, uh, afraid to tell you their secrets that you unmask them, you're going to be separated from this person. You're going to go no contact because magic is working in your life at the moment. You're entering this unknown territory. You got to go through this transformation. It's going to be a shock to many people, but just let it fucking shock them because the time has come. This man's done this to you, infinity. You got to get out of this infinity. Look at that infinity sign. They've done it to you so much that you you can't even count. That's how so much they've done it to you. All right, collective, and I hope this helps somebody today because I thought it was a good reading, and I appreciate each and every one of you all. And then over here it says. Because strife is coming to this man. Look, he's getting burned for things that he's done to you. And look, that looks like Leo and Saturn, or North Node and Truth. Saturn, Truth. Yeah, they fucked up. This is... They're trying to keep you in strife over all their illusions. All this illusion, uh, they didn't want this secret out. They didn't want this secret out because they would lose their per their partner that they're married with. That's why. They and and uh, but they're in love with this other. They're in love with this man, and you don't know it. And and they're wanting you to feel like you're never going to be a success, but God and divine knows you are a success, and this person's trying to hold you back. They're trying to hold you back from going towards your love. They're trying to keep you in strife so you won't speak your truth to your love. And uh, it's just an illusion. They're, they're, they're trying to def defame your character. That's what they're doing. Despire and cruelty. They're being cruel. But they they ain't getting no sleep at night, this motherfucker. And it's because they tried to ruin you. They trying to ruin you behind behind your back. You're gonna receive a message. Uh, it's gonna be incoming fast. It could be from a Taurus Gemini, double Gemini. But it's it's gonna be a quick message is coming to you from this King of Cups, this man that loves you. And that's Libra and Scorpio, double Scorpio. So that's a lot of water. They they really love you. And look at that owl in front of that king. He's got a lot of wisdom. And he knows who to give his fucking love to. There's an eagle above him. And that's about love. See, he's bringing his love. Oh, and then we have uh, Queen of Cups. And that's Gemini and Double Cancer. So you saw through. You're like a high priestess. You're very intuitive and wise and loving and caring. And look, there you are. You're all a match. What they didn't know is uh, you don't really care. They tried to ruin you, and that's all right. But but there's a message coming to you. Somebody loves you, and you're all wanting to be together. You all feel wish fulfillment with each other. You all want to receive material wealth, nine of cups. That's the judgment. The angels called this judgment for this man doing this shit to you behind your back. Looky there. Looky there. So uh, the angels is helping you, and this person... They, they can't stop this love. That's the judgment. They can't stop it. This is your new beginning with your love. You've been alchemizing it. You've been alchemizing it. And that's all that matters. So it's getting ready to take place, Collective. And I love that reading. If you love this reading, please help me today and help get it round. And I love you guys. And I appreciate you very much. And I'm going to get off here and make me some breakfast. Because it's, it's early. It ain't even 7 o'clock this morning. And I love you guys. And pa pa pieces.